please join me in the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please join me in singing our national anthem. Dear God, we gather here today to celebrate the accomplishments of these graduates. We thank you for the gift of education and for the opportunities it provides. We ask that you bless these graduates with the strength and courage to pursue their dreams and to use their talents and abilities to make a positive difference in the world. Que estos graduados vayan adelante con el conocimiento de que son amados y apoyados por sus familias, amigos y comunidad. Que sean guiados por tu sabiduría y gracia. Y que siempre recuerden los valores y lecciones que aprendieron en su tiempo aquí. We ask all of this in your holy name. Amen. Please be seated. Welcome to the Gainesville High School graduation ceremony for the class of 2023. Tonight we celebrate the accomplishments of these outstanding graduates. The class of 2023 began their four years facing historic events and circumstances that could have easily set them back many years. Despite these challenges, our graduates have proved stronger, rising above, and then even exceeding expectations, setting the standards for future GSF classes. Whether it be the record number of NCTC graduates, 21, who received either an associate's graduate or an industry certification just two weeks ago in this very arena, or our Red Coat Band members winning sweepstakes each of their four years. Whether it be our athletes who once again made leopard playoff appearances commonplace with a record number of signed to play at the next level, or our congressional debaters that reached the state finals battling it out on the floor of our state capitol. Whether it be a total of nine seniors who have reached state level competition from the aforementioned athletics and debate to UIL academics, FCCLA, and even HOSA. Or with an assist from our friends from, with Talent Search, a record $3.3 million worth of scholarships awarded. The Gainesville High School class of 2023 has set the mark for future GHS classes to attain. Great job, Leopards. Tonight, we must begin a recognition with the parents and family of our graduates. You have been there every step of the way with encouragement, support, and guidance. This evening is a culmination of your tireless efforts. Congratulations to you on this special evening. We'd also like to recognize our Board of Trustees and Superintendent. 
Their work behind the scenes has provided direction and guidance for the, dis for the district towards the goal of success for every student. We ask that each of you stand when your name is called and remain standing until all have been recognized. Superintendent, Dr. Desmonte Stewart. <laughs> Deputy Superintendent, Lucretia Stilley. Our board president, Mr. Corey Harden. Our board vice president, Mr. Marvin Royal. Board secretary, Mr. Nathan Dempsey. Ms. Leticia Hendricks. Ms. Laura Otts. And Mr. Phil Neely. Thank you all. We'd also like to recognize our outstanding faculty for their contributions to our graduate success. Your incredible efforts through the strains of the aforementioned challenges have had a major effect on our students' accomplishments. Besides the hours of preparing and delivering instruction, many of you sponsor, coach, or direct our students to extraordinary levels. Your impact on each student will last a lifetime. Would you please stand? Thank you. We would also like to recognize our counselors, Ms. Jill Brown, Ms. Nicole Rich, and Ms. Kim Parsons. They balance the laborious task of checking credits and fixing class schedules with the most important task of providing emotional support for our students. Thank you all. And a special thanks to go out to our assistant principals, Ms. Megan Chortis, Ms. Kristen Searcy, Mr. Or Dr. Kevin Jackson, and Mr. Kyle Searcy. You take students' success to a personal level. The long hours after school combined with the constant conversations with both students and family has been a catalyst to so many students. Thank you. And finally, again, to Ms. Rich and Ms. Stradley for your organizational efforts in making this evening possible. From senior parent meetings to, log to the logistical coordination of the events that have led to this commencement, this evening would not be possible without the hours that you put in. Thank you. <laughs> Lastly, I would now like to recognize the following graduates who will begin military service shortly after graduation. Please stand or remain standing until all names have been called. U.S. Army, Jonathan Carroll. <laughs> Anthony Galaviz. <laughs> and Mauricio Martinez. <laughs> U.S. Navy, Kylan Medina. and U.S. Marine Corps, Haley Huerta, <laughs> Alessandro Contreras, <laughs> Eliud Hernandez, <laughs> Richard King, <laughs> and Luis Roque. <laughs> Thank you all. Leah Magallanes will not come forward to recognize the stoles and cords our graduates are wearing. One of the strengths of GHS, yes, one of the strengths of GHS is a high level of participation and achievement outside of the classroom. These stoles and cords speak to the level of involvement and performance. Leah? recognized as we walked in tonight, many of us are wearing colorful stoles, cords, and medals. These indicate some of the honors and achievements we have accomplished while in high school. Students, please stand as your group is recognized. 
The first two people that we will recognize are the valedictorian and salutatorian of our class. Would Andrew Hober, valedictorian, and Tatum Raines, salutatorian, please stand. Both of these students have medals around their necks signifying their high academic achievements. You may be seated. Would the students who are wearing a double silver cord please stand? These students are in the top 10% of our class. They have gone above and beyond in maintaining a high grade point average for the past four years by taking honor classes as well as dual credit classes to achieve this honor. Please be seated. Would the students wearing the single silver cord please stand? This group of students earned either a 60 hour associate's degree, a level one welding certificate, or a cosmetology certificate from North Texas College. And walk the stage at NCTC graduation on May 5th. They have been working toward this accomplishment for the past four years. Please be seated. Okay. Would the students wearing a red, white, and blue cord please stand? Those who receive the, these cords are Red River Promise Bound. They have completed the minimum requirements for program eligibility and submitted a co college entry and FAFSA application to a Red River Promising Partnering College. Please be seated. Would this member of the National Honor Society please stand? The students who are wearing the white soles have maintained a 4.1 GPA, exhibited quali qualities of leadership and character, and have completed a minimum of 20 or more hours of community service during each semester of membership. The students wearing the golden medallions with their white sole have gone above and beyond by completing 150 or more hours of community service. Collectively, this group of students has earned 3,550 hours to, to our community. Well done, you may be seated. If you were a TRIO Talent Search member wearing a red, black, and white cord, please stand. Wearing this cord signifies these students have invested in their futures by working incredibly hard to submit multiple applications and essay for colleges admissions and scholarships. They have maintained a long tradition of t TRIO students who have worked hard, are the first and break barriers. They have prepared to walk onto their campus of choice in the fall and successfully chase their dreams. Please be seated. Would the AVID students please stand? AVID via individual determination or AVID is a college reading this program designed to increase school-wide learning and performance. Students who have completed four years of AVID are wearing a white sole. These are the students, those who are wearing black, a white, black cord have completed two or three years in the program. You may be seated. Would the students wearing a pink cord please stand? These students are the members of either Varsity Leopard or the Red Coat Band. Please be seated. The student, students who are members of Gainesville High School chap, chapter of the International Thespian Society and wearing a blue and gold cord please stand. The purpose, the purpose of the International Thespian Society is to honor students' achievement and commitment to the art of theater. Through hard work, sacrifice, and dedication, these students have earned sufficient points to have the right to, call, to, to be called thespians. Please be seated. Will the students who are members of the Leopard Speech and Debate Program please stand? These students have earned this honor by completing and competing in speaking events throughout high school and have received their red and gray cords by competing at the UIL district contest in their events. You may be seated. If you are wearing a red and white cord, please stand. 
These students are members of the Family, Career, and Community Learn Learners of America Student Organization. These students have displayed leadership and community service skills by participating in and competing FCCLA national programs while taking culinary art classes. Please be seated. If you are wearing a light blue cord, please stand. These students earned their Serve Safe Food Protection Management Certificate for excellence in food safety and sanitary training during the culinary art classes in Hospitality and Tourism Pathway. Please be seated. If you are wearing a light blue and royal cord, please stand. These students earned the America Culinary Fellow Federation Certificate Federalism Cook Certificate while completing their culinary art classes. Please stand if you are wearing a blue and gold cord and are members of the National FFA Organization. These students are active FFA members who have served on various and participated in leadership and judgment teams. These students represent primary leadership and personal growth and career success. You may be seated. If you are wearing a silver and teal cord, please stand. This cord is for completing four out credits in health, our health science pathway. Please be seated. If you are wearing a skeptical, please stand. The skeptical signifies active per participation in our health career student organization, organization, HOSA. Please be seated. If you are wearing a purple and silver cord, please stand. These students took and passed their patient care technician certificate this spring. Please be seated. If you are a black and silver cord, please stand. These students took and passed their certificate clinical medical assistant certificate this spring. You may be seated. Were the students wearing a black double cord, please stand. These students have been leaders in, our, in student government for two, two years or more, whether as class officers or student body council members. The leadership and commitment they have shown to Gainesville High School in an effort to make this a great place to be have a huge difference inside the building in our community. Please be seated. Would the key club members please stand? These students are wearing a royal blue cord. They have received this cord for their participa participation in our community throughout the Gainesville co organization. You may be seated. Our last group are our law enforcement students. If you are wearing a black and blue cord, please stand. These students have completed our four-year pathway in law enforcement. Please be seated. Congratulations on your accomplishment, class of 2023. Good job, William. We will now recognize our valedictorian and salutatorian for the class of 2023. Their hard work and persistence over the last four years allows them to now address their class. First, we'll hear from our salutatorian, Tatum Raines. He will be followed by valedictorian, Andrew Hober. Tate.
Good evening, friends, family, faculty, and of course, my fellow 2023 graduates. My name is Taylor Haynes, and I'm the salutatorian of the class of 2023. It is both my honor and responsibility to welcome you all to the momentous occasion that is this year's graduation ceremony. Throughout high school, everyone has a unique experience, whether it be participating in as many extracurriculars as possible or avoiding them at all costs. Although some of us have had different paths, we've all made it to this day, graduation. This is the day that we have all dreamed of, dreaded, and even stressed for throughout more than a decade of schooling. Through blood, sweat, and tears, literally, we have finally finished high school. For as long as I can remember, parents, teachers, and family have told me that school would go by fast, yet it seemed for a long time as if school would drag on for an eternity. However, when I look back today and think of memories both good and bad and everything in between, school has gone by much faster than it seemed in those moments. Throughout the 12 years we have been together, all the way from elementary school to high school, the fellow students and even faculty we have spent such a large portion of our lives with have grown to be a sort of secondary family. These family-like relationships have developed over more than a decade of schooling and have impacted us all in different ways. Personally, these relationships are what caused high school to pass by so quickly. It is the small moments that we share with these close friends and family that force it to pass by at such a quick rate. But it is also these moments that make all of our experiences unforgettable and unique in their own right. Whether it be an inside joke, something completely random, or a Mason your mama joke, these are some of the things that helped high school be an unforgettable experience. When we were freshmen, we were all eager to get into high school and blow through it as quickly as possible. However, now that we are graduating tonight, I can tell many of us aren't ready to go yet. It is awfully ironic thinking of how ready we, were all to go, we all were to go out into the real world. Although everyone here tonight has a different path, we will all be flung out into the real world immediately after this moment. Whether you're going directly into the workforce, trade school, or university, it is also important to have a plan for your future. The real world can be ruthless, cruel, but also can be rewarding. It is almost entirely up to us for what we want each of our futures to look like. This is why it is important to have a plan, apply ourselves, and use the skills we learned all throughout our high school experience. As we move into this next phase of our lives, it is important to cherish all of the experiences, friendships, and moments that have shaped us to be who we are today. These seemingly small moments are memories that will last a lifetime. To my fellow graduates and everyone who has shown their support over the years, to each and every one of us, this is a night we will always remember and cherish as we step into our bright futures. Thank you and congratulations to the graduating class of 2023. this day would come. These last four years have felt like forever, yet also lightning fast. For the amount of days we have all prayed for the time to take faster in class, it's crazy to think so many of us wish it wasn't over yet. There is comfort and security within the high school walls. It's hard to even remember a time before high school. However, it's important to remember when we are ourselves or outside of our comfort zone, we change for the better and learn more about ourselves. I experienced this firsthand as I entered high school. Confronted with more people in my grade than my entire middle school had, I was presented with two options. Stay within my shell or expand my horizons. Having explored both of these paths, I can confidently say stepping out of my comfort zones is the better option. My game plan freshman year and sophomore year was just to get the good grades and stomach through the rest, and you all have opened my eyes to so much more, and I couldn't imagine what these two last two years would be like otherwise. Between joining clubs and groups and just meeting some of the most absolute coolest, most unique people, I'm so glad to have experienced this with all of you. I urge all of you to continue, to continue forth with the same energy, regardless of what life has in store for you in these next years. So while you not, might not remember each individual lesson, I hope you can take with you the things you learned about yourself. The habits, both good and bad, the values, and what you love to do. Now. Now that we all understand ourselves more clearly, this is a better time than ever to explore the world and apply everything we learned up to this point. After today, we all have a clean slate, and if you take away anything from this, I hope it's not to be too scared and to open yourself up and to be yourself. To not be afraid to learn more, meet others, or to be vulnerable in general. Having spent nearly every day of the last four years with many of you, I can say you all have something to provide and to add to the table, so I truly hope you take the opportunities provided and the ones which have yet to reveal themselves with open arms. So all, 
you all have changed going from class, from being a chore, to being something I'm going to miss dearly. So I'm sad to be separated from all my friends and all the amazing people in our class. I'm also just so excited to see what the future holds for all of you and to see all of your accomplishments. There are so many talented, unique individuals in our class. I just know you will all go so far. Thank you all so much, and congratulations to every one of you. Dr. Seward, as a principal of Gainesville High School, I hereby certify that the following students have met the state and lo local requirements for high school graduation as set forth by the Texas Education Agency and the Gainesville Independent School District Board of Trustees. I present to you the 2023 graduating class of Gainesville High School. Thank you, Mr. Glancy. As the superintendent of schools and on behalf of the Board of Trustees of the Gainesville Independent School District, it is my pleasure to accept these students who have met the graduation requirements as candidates for graduation. On the recommendations of the administration and staff of Gainesville High School and by the authority and power vested in me by the Board of Trustees of Gainesville Independent School District and the state of Texas, I confer upon these candidates who have met all graduation requirements the Gainesville Independent School District High School Diploma and declare them graduates of the class of 2023. Congratulations, graduates. We are so very proud of you. Leopard Nation, my name is Dez Stewart, and I have the honor of serving as the superintendent of the Gainesville Independent School District. It is my pleasure to welcome you to the beautiful campus of the University of North Texas as we prepare to celebrate the many accomplishments of the Gainesville High School graduating class of 2023. On behalf of the GISD Board of Trustees, I extend a hearty welcome to each of our guests, parents, grandparents, and most importantly, the Gainesville High School 2023 senior class. As we embrace this momentous event tonight, I'm reminded of the joy we all share in witnessing these young people walk through this ceremony, marking a significant moment in their lives. This occasion embodies the body of work that I, as superintendent of schools, consider one of the most rewarding days of, your school, of the school year. But, but first, let me give credit where credit is due. I want to say thank you to our parents, guardians, family members, and friends for your unconditional love and support of these young men and young ladies who are about to start the next phase of life. I also want to thank our Board of Trustees. These individuals volunteer countless hours of their time working to ensure that our faculty, staff, and students have what they need to be successful inside and out of the classroom. I also want to thank Team GISD for a job well done. Our faculty and staff, regardless of position, do an amazing job ensuring that our kids have safe, clean, and educationally challenging learning environments. Thanks for making the magic happen and equipping our kids with the prerequisite skills needed each step along the way of their academic journey. Thanks for the early mornings, time spent covering classes due to lack of substitute teachers, the late afternoons, and the countless number of hours spent on weekends planning and preparing quality lessons for our students. <laughs> Lastly, I want to say thank you to my students. You have spent the last 13 years of your life preparing for this very day, and you made it. I cannot say how proud I am of you all. It has been a very special year, and that is because of you. Hold your heads high as you enter into the real world and represent us and your families in a first-class manner in whatever your future endeavors may be. Looking out into, looking out into the sea of red caps and gowns, 
I see just how far you have progressed. You possess the pride and confidence of a high school graduate. It has been an honor and a privilege to be a part of that journey for the last five years. A journey filled with wonderful memories of all those who have supported you throughout your education in Gainesville. Your parents have helped you, encouraged you, picked you up when you fell down, and loved you unconditionally. Our many gifted and talented teachers have helped you to discover your abilities and to develop an inquiring mind. I assure you that although you're moving beyond high school, those same teachers will remember you, hoping their encouragement has traveled with you on your journey. Your coaches and sponsors have nurtured you outside of the classroom through lessons of cooperation, sportsmanship, competition, and compassion. There are countless individuals who have supported you, some whose influence is known only to you. Then, of course, there are your friends who surround you today. Some of those friendships might be relatively new or may even extend into your preschool days. Nurture those friendships and carry them forward as, the new, as you enter this new phase of life. There are so many facets to this wonderful memories you have collected. Treasure them all. Today concludes a significant and wonderful chapter of your life. An equally significant and wonderful chapter is about to begin. A chapter filled with the adventures of the adults you are becoming. You are leaving a world where others have made decisions for you. You are about to leave your comfort zone. Soon, you will be making decisions, solving problems, and, decide, and deciding which road to travel. It sounds exciting, and it will be, but it will always have its challenges. When you are challenged or discouraged, I hope you will remember your years in GISD and the lessons learned at home and in school. They will give you strength and courage. Have faith in yourself and the unique individual you are. Be true to yourself. Instead of the world changing you, you can help change the world. Your family has nurtured you. The Gainesville Independent School District has guided you. And now it is your turn to identify your, and acknowledge your strengths, talents, and interests. Find what you love. Be passionate about it. Learn all you can. Be kind, considerate, and positive. Take time for others. Be an active member in your community. Volunteer your time. There is great need, there's a great need for generous, caring people in our world. To the class of 2023, I wish you nothing but the best as you go on your way. I trust you will make the most of the opportunities you will encounter throughout your acclimation to the real world. With the knowledge you have gained in school, with the guidance of your family and the wonderful friendships you have made, I am confident you will succeed, you will find success and happiness. Congratulations to the Gainesville High School Class of 2023. Now, for the moment we've all been waiting for, let's hand out some diplomas. Would the front row please stand? Andrew John Hober. Tatum Bryce Rains. Tatum Bryce Rains. Nolan Bradford Gardner. Elena Jane Dennison. Paula Rico.
Benson Huyen Tuan. Cheslina Adelia Bercheron. <laughs> Haley Marie Caldwell. <laughs> Noe Fabian Martinez. Natalie K. Montoya. Adriana Nicole Polikit Galano. Leonardo Elias. Pablo Gael Moreno. Cooper Wayne Emerson. Mason Michael Bean. Jalen Nicole Graham. Javier Dario Ferrare. Arlen Alvarez. Alexa Grace Green. Zayla Isabel Alonso Fernandez. Sydney Deanne Alford. Maddie Jade Amato. Fernanda Michelle Aranda Ramirez. Alexis Avalos. Ciara Yacadine Ayala. Melanie Baltazar. <laughs> Gustavo Barcenas. <laughs> Hania Alexia Baron. Trayvon Joseph Bell. <laughs> Levi Winston Brock. <laughs> Alex Gabriel Buenos Aires. <laughs> Shashari Buenteo. Charles Perry Burks. <laughs> Jacob Ryan Burnett. <laughs> Zunaida Renee Calderon. Jonathan David Carroll. Brian. 
Brian Manuel Sedeo. Yahira Berlin Serda. Matthew Victor Chadis. Ting Yu Chow. Abigail Rose Cochran. Alessandro Yair Contreras Guerra. Sophia Naomi Corona. Francisco Costilla. Milani Chiara Curry. Celeste Nevea Davis. Michaela June Davis. LaBria Michelle Dunley. Cheyenne Aaliyah Dunlop. Elizabeth Ann Evans. Yesenia Abigail Fierro. Crystal Faith Figueroa. Kamaya Monia Franklin. Dea Diane Frazier. Valeria Jasmine Fuentes Ornelas. Joanna Soledad Galan. Anthony Drake Galaviz. Hunter Blair Gajubinski. Angel Eduardo Galvez Arellano. Eliana Garcia. Noemi Chilali Garcia. Paul Alejandro Garcia Perez. Ashlyn Page Garrison. Tay Elizabeth Gilbreth. Caitlin Gomez. Maria Fernanda Gomez. Miguel Angel Gomez. Elijah Daniel Gonzalez. Landon Paul 
Gonzalez. Hugo Alexander Gonzalez. Jessica Gonzalez. Judith Gonzalez. Selena Jasmine Gonzalez. Valeria Estefani Gonzalez Betancourt. Mia Gonzalez Perez. Angelina Larry Gatluski. Saul Govea. Brandon Allen Graham. Colin Seth Green. Braulio Guerrero. Juan Diego Guerrero. Demarion DeMonte Devon Haley. Jaden Danielle Harris. Ethan Malik Hendricks. Maxwell Joe Henry. Anaya Lizette Hernandez. Eliud Hernandez. Nicholas Isai Hernandez. Chayton Thurman Holly. Christopher Dale Hollowell. Alexis Joel Huerta. Anna Lizeth Huerta. Haley Huerta. Itzel Ariana Huerta. Mariela Huerta. Leonardo Hutado. Roy Eric Ibarra. Ashton Reese Johnson. Devin DeRay Johnson. Kennedy Ray Jones. Richard Colin Martin King. Charles Raymond Kleeman. Jacqueline Laura. Hey! 
Shailen and Desiree LaSalle. Ian Mitchell Lukowski. Miranda Suzette Lira. Adriana Nicole Lopez. Coral Lopez. Eddie Lopez. Lady Guadalupe Lopez Alviso. James Kinseth Lowry. Hector Daniel Lozano. Leah Magallanes. Richard Lamar Manuel. Alyssa Domini Marquez Tenorio. Bryce Caden Martin. Alan J.C. Martinez. Andy Martinez. Christian Martinez. Destiny Desiree Martinez. Mariella Martinez. Mauricio Martinez. Eros Yael Martinez Lopez. Derek Curtis Massey. Jesse James McLean. Eric Efren Medina. Kylin Isabel Medina. Dulce Narit Mahia Samarepa. Jennifer Mahia Samarepa. Jesus Melchor. Jasmine Victoria Melendez. Ramon Uriel Menchaca. Daniela Mercado. Isaias Miranda. Samantha Monique Morales. Jacob Reese Morgan. Theresa Marie Moat. Jacob Elijah Munoz. 
Sergio Adu Munoz. Caitlin Ann Murphy. Riley Ann Neal. Alexa Marie Nieves. Jonathan Nunez. Samantha Mia Olvera. Brianna Nevea Ordu. Diana Maria Orozco Almanza. Javier Alejandro Ortega. Nagali Guadalupe Ortiz. Alex Gilberto Ortiz Franco. Francisco Roberto Ortiz Franco. Daniel Ivan Padron. Daniel Ivan Padron. Ratzel Patel. Christian Perez. Gustavo Angel Perez. Ariadna Ramos. Jaceline Alexis Ray. Dylan Lane Reeser. Prisaya Daniel Reed. Jennifer Resendez Castillo. Yannette Rios. Herminia Siani Rivera. Dominic Anthony Robinson. Jose Robles Gomez. Isabel Rojas. Luis Fernando Roque. Owen Tobias Rommel Rucker. Sierra Keely Ruiz. Mariana Sines. Isaiah Patrick Lee George Salazar. Jasmine Salinas. Sarai Isabel Samos. Alexis Christine Samuel. Dana Mariah Sacedo. Andrew Philip Shonifer. Micah James Sharp.
Desiree Guantanet Sheffield. Eve Lillian Smith. Alexis Soto. Sadie Lee Page Spivey. Chandler Brock Stradley. Alex Susteda. Zachary Trevor Tucker. Olivia Grace Vasquez. Alexis Gabriel Vasquez. Carlos Caleb Vega. James Dylan Ware. Anissa Shanice White. Jasmine Elizabeth Whited. Trinity Shar Wilson. Martha Giselle Zamora. Nicole Marie Miller. Tyler Joseph Walden. Rogelio Mercado. Angel Yahir Gutierrez Chavez. Ladies and gentlemen, that is the class of 2023 Gainesville High School. of 2022 to please stand. 2023, please stand. Today we will be closing a chapter in our life to soon open up a new one. As we stand here together one last time, let us reflect and remember all the memories we have shared together, the bonds we have built, and the obstacles we have faced. But let's also remember in our next chapter to stay true to ourselves, enjoy the little things, aim for your highest level of success, and stay humble and hopeful in all aspects of your life. At the end of today, it isn't goodbye, but hello to the graduating class of 2023. Please, let's turn our tassels to the left as we begin our new chapter in life. Let's bow our heads and give our gratitude to our Heavenly Father. Dear Lord, we thank you for this day. 
after today, each individual in this room will go on their own paths and begin their own journey. We ask that you guide us and bless us through everything with passion, wisdom, strength, and love. Today, we also pray for tomorrow. This graduation opens another door to another time. As you have led in the past, lead now in the future. Give us focus, clarity, and a calling from you to understand our purpose and the courage to respond and step toward that purpose. Thank you for the families, friends, and faculty members that have led each one of us here. Most of all, we thank you. May your integrity be a gift to the world, and may your spirit be with us always. Amen. Please join us in the singing of our alma mater.